Thank you. Thanks. So, um, how do you know Brennan? We're old friends from high school. Oh, so you're uh, from Central Valley? Yeah. Oh, cool. Yeah. Um, he told me a bit about it. He says it's uh, pretty boring. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's not you. Yeah, same for me. It's the situation. Exactly. I mean, I'm sorry if it doesn't seem like I'm trying. No, I'm the one who isn't really trying. I'm just kind of tired of this. This is my fourth blind date this month. Really? <laughs> me too. Really? Yeah, I, I've been set up by four separate friends. One of them was this stupid uh, speed dating thing. Really? <sighs> yeah, my friends think I am lonely and need a boyfriend. <laughs> and then the date doesn't go well, and then my friend... Blame it on you? I hate that. Yeah, they think I'm awkward, but it's not me who's awkward. It's, it's, it's the, the situation. situation. Gosh, finally somebody who understands. <laughs> And then she told me she's not the type of girl to be in a committed relationship, so there's the deal breaker. I'm sorry about that. What about you? Are, uh, are you a relationship girl? Well, to find relationship girl. You know, only one. Give your heart away. It's been tough to keep faith in that idea. It's not easy to find romance in real life, is it? It's just meet someone, sleep together, leave, and forget all about them. Well, is that what you think? Are you going to sleep with me? <laughs> not a chance. Then of course I don't think that. Great. I'll have this back to you in a few minutes. You know, Mark, I actually enjoyed this date. Really? I thought you weren't into me. I'm cautious. Like you said, it's hard to believe in romance. Ugh, this song. What? What's wrong with this song? Well, this was the song that was playing at prom when my boyfriend of two years was dancing with Amanda Davidson. Well, it's just dancing. It doesn't mean anything, right? Of course not. She has a baby now. Gave birth that February. So guess when that happened? Same night as prom. Sorry. Yeah, sorry. Everyone's sorry. Even he was doesn't change the fact that he cheated on me. But that doesn't have to change you. What's that supposed to mean? This ex of yours? He's one guy, and an idiot of a guy at that. If he's stupid enough to betray you, then he never deserved you in the first place. No, no, listen. I've never made a strong connection with those other girls. You draw me in somehow. You caught my attention, and I don't want to lose yours. Thank you. Enjoy your night. Listen, Jenna, I want to get to know you better. Look, I don't know if I can. Here. Call me sometime. I don't think so, Mark. You seem like a great guy, but I'm not... I don't know if I have it in me to... Care about someone again? Risk getting hurt again? 
I can't guarantee that I won't hurt you. And even if I did promise, you couldn't fully believe me. But isn't that romance? It's risky. And isn't that risk what makes us appreciate it when the real thing finally finds us? You're cute. And you're sweet. And that means you have trouble written all over you. I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go home. I'm gonna hang my coat up. I'm gonna take my shoes off. And I'm gonna crumple this up and throw it away. I'd understand if you did. But I sincerely hope you don't.